you can see over here we do have the dates we do have the states the respective names and also the claim expenses so now what i'm going to do is i want to construct a dashboard inside my excel file using this raw data so what i do is i put my cursor on the data and then i press ctrl a so once i press ctrl a you will notice that the entire data is highlighted and then i go to insert i click pivot table a box will appear so what i'm going to do is i want to use a worksheet so that we can go to a new sheet so i press ok so once we click ok you will notice that we will go to a new worksheet so the next thing is what i'm going to do is i just want to put the state at the row i want to put the order date in the filter and i want to put the claims at the filter and i just want to put the rm and the values okay so the next thing is so this is the currency so i just press right click sort largest to the smallest so this is how it works and then what i'm going to do is i want to highlight all this right click format cells i go to accounting i remove the decimal places i remove the symbol so now it looks better and presentable so what i'm going to do is i just want to put the rm over here again so now we have this go to conditional formatting i click home i click conditional formatting and then i go to data bus i just click this of course if you notice we do have the numbers written over here so conditional formatting i go to manage rule i edit the rule and i show bar only and i click a different color maybe darker and i press ok and ok so now it looks better so what i'm going to do is i'm going to put this this name will be expenses claim expenses and this name will be the performance all right and then i go to design i go to grand totals i off so now we don't have this and then i go to pivot table analyze i go to insert slicer and i can tweak the claims all right so now you just see i click medical expenses you will notice that pulau pinang has the highest claim expenses if you just say i click traveling expenses you will notice that perlis has the highest traveling expenses and if i click food and entertainment that means the employees from selangor are using are incurring the highest claim expenses so this is how we can do a presentation you also can also insert timeline whereby you go to pivot table analyze insert timeline and you click the order date and you press okay so in this context so if just say i want to know the performance of january so in january selangor has the highest claim expenses if i untick this so we know that there are few states that incur the claim expenses in january if you say i click february so this is the states that incur the claim expenses during the month of february